How do I collect all the open world alchemy knowledge points? I'm going to show you on this video. Before we get into it though, I'm going to recommend that you have one add-on. That add-on is TomTom. Tom. What that's going to allow you to do, in case you don't know, is you're going to be able to take a set of coordinates, like I'm going to list in the description for all these points uh, in the video, and you're going to be able to plug that in in-game. It's going to give you a custom waypoint. It's going to make stuff a lot easier to find. Let's get into it. Alright guys, so for the first alchemy open world knowledge point, it's real easy. It's going to be right up here by Algathar Academy in Thaldrassus. Alright, and it's going to be called the Contraband Concoction. And it's going to be kind of hard to see, but uh, it's next to the Master of Illusions, the Professor right here. And you're going to want to zoom in, and it's going to be right down here in the grass, this little purple thing. You're just going to be able to loot it, and pick it up, and that's three knowledge points right there. Alright guys, so for point number two, we got the Canteen of Suspicious Water. Um, that's going to be right here in the Onaran Plains by the Fork River Crossing. Uh, it's going to be down here inside of a cave, so you're going to want to fly down. You're going to see this big cave entrance, and you're going to run inside. It's going to be at the back of this cave right here. There's going to be a dead explorer on the ground right here. Let me kill this thing. Um. Alright, perfect. So right here in the water you're going to see the Lost Expedition Scout and next to him is going to be the Canteen of Suspicious Water. Simply loot the canteen and there's three more knowledge points for you. Alright guys, point number three is the Well Insulated Mug. You're going to find that uh, in the waking shore below the Obsidian Citadel. It's right here. Um, obviously, the coordinates are going to be in the description. So all you do with this one is you just walk up to in plain sight, open it up, and you got three more points right there. All right, guys. Next point, point four, I believe, is going to be the Frost Forge Potion. Uh, that's going to be in the Waking Shores. Let me open the map up for you. Right here in the Waking Shores, in the middle of this big blue circle down here. Uh, obviously, coordinates in the description. Uh, for this one, it's really easy. You're just going to need to kill. Uh, kill these whelps that won't quit spawning. You're gonna open this guy up right here, Frost Forge Potion, and boom, you got three more alchemy points. Alright, guys, next point. Uh, this one's gonna involve a little bit of a mini game. This is the Furry Gloop uh, Knowledge Point. So, what you're gonna need to do for this one is first of all, clear out all these knolls around here. Uh, it's gonna make your life a lot easier. So, get these killed. Alright, and then you're gonna see these docile cubs on the ground right here. You're going to want to pick up the cubs, just like this, and you're going to walk them over to each of these cauldrons, and you're going to drop the docile cub. Oh. Guess you're not going to do that, you're actually going to click the cauldron with it. And out's going to come this decayed cub slime goop stuff. You're going to want to kill this, and everything else that hits you around here, because there's about 4,000 different mobs. Another docile cub is over here. Pick him up. So I'm going to be getting chased this entire time. Go put him in the other cauldron right here. Kill whatever spawns once again. And then the last docile cub is right down here by the water. Pick him up once again and run him back over to the last cauldron. Go over to the cauldron, throw him in there, and boom. You're gonna have a little, little thing spawn on you again, but as you just saw pop up on my screen, uh, the item that you're actually looking for is just gonna get placed right in your backpack, and that is three more <coughs> knowledge points for you guys. Alright guys, next one's gonna be nice and easy. Uh, it is the fire water powder that is going to be in the Azure Span, right below Thaldrassus, up here at the very top, uh, right above Theron's Watch. And you're probably going to have to kill a couple Yetis when you come over here, but it's simply just going to be sitting on the ground nice and easy. Just loot it, and there you go, you got another three points. Alright guys, and then for the last point right here, uh, you're going to come to the Azure Span. Uh, this is going to be the Experimental Decay Cauldron. It's going to be at the bottom of the map by Brackenhide Hollow. Um, right here. Obviously coordinates are going to be in the description. You're going to land in the middle and you're going to have to kill about 4 million gnolls. 
as you can see I just did right here um, and after you do that you're just gonna be able to loot this thing and there you go three more knowledge points for you alright guys if you found that video helpful please consider liking and subscribing um, if you enjoy this content you're probably gonna enjoy the other content that I put out too it's that simple um, until next time thanks